Yeah, Steve, um, not the way you wanted the game to end. Obviously, that was uh, that was a horrible last 10 minutes. Mm. Yeah, yeah, there's no hiding away from that and we have to own up to that. Um, it's obviously on us. It's a real pity because, um, you know, up until their first goal, it was a complete one-sided uh, affair. We're disappointed not to be, you know, a goal or two up at half time. Um, but the, the the message was keep going on a lot of things, change not, not change, but do a couple of things a little bit better. To be fair to the lads, they did that really well, in in and then you know improving the performance even more in the start of the second half, get getting the two in the lead and and we're completely comfortable. You know, it's a couple of changes that we had to make, which. Um, it's fair enough, you know, lads coming back from international duty telling us how they feel and, you know, um, we have to respect that and um, so we make a couple of changes that probably we wouldn't have made but we, but we had to and then, um, but I wouldn't say that changed the game, what changed the game was, the, was their first goal and for all, all of a threat that Luton can be from set pieces, it's probably the worst delivery of, of the day and you, it's clear to see how poorly we've defended it and then the, the momentum and the game changes just from that one you know, instance, and then um, and then the second goal, we're just clearly not strong enough, and uh, um, with the ball ball in the box. So um, it's really hard to talk about uh, or to talk really positively about all the good things that happened in the game today, and because there was up until that first goal, their first goal, because of the way the um, the game has ended and the result that we that we uh, we've ended up getting. And of course, it's a point, but it's 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 it feels like a loss, and um, it's too two point drops for sure. Yeah. Um, you mentioned those changes that you had to make just after the, well immediately after the second goal mm. while, while the celebrations were going on and, and you said you had to make those. Just, yeah well Willie will to be fair, yeah, yeah Willie said that uh, you know Ibrahim not long been back in um, in, in the country and um, um, you know and the, the flight and, and the, the timing we had you know, like, listen there's no excuse don't get me wrong but it's it, it, it probably you don't normally change the centre back of course you don't um, but we, you know, we respect the situation and their honesty, and um, and that's that. But but you know, it's it, listen, substitutions happen all the time now, and you know we've we've stood here quite a few times this season, and about how well you know Yates has done when he's come on, and Czech who's done, and uh, Woody's come on and scored. So you know, most of the time this season we've been talking about the positive um, influence the substitutions have had on the game. But I don't think the substitutions have have had the fact now the game has ended. It's just that one set piece that has just changed the complete momentum of the of the game. And if um, whoever had been on the pitch, you know, I think that would have happened. Um, do you almost look back at the, some of the chances you created and didn't mm. score in the first half almost as, as much well, as, the, you know, those last few minutes? Because you could now. have been four or five up. Yeah, and we should have kept a clean sheet. You know, it wasn't that first goal. It wasn't as if, like, Luton were getting a lot of set pieces or a lot of balls in the box or shooting and... It couldn't have been any further from that. It's a goal that's come out of absolutely nowhere and changed the game completely. So, um, so you, you'll look at that now and go, we could have been walking in half time, one or two up, but uh, but we weren't. But we did go two nil up and we're very comfortable. And, and and for me, I just thought the minimum this game would be was two nil because we didn't look like conceding. And if anything, we would have scored uh, or could have scored another another one or two maybe. But all that is hypothetical because of what happened from that set piece and onwards. I know, as you've said, it's it's tough to, to look at positives, but you can, can't you? You can look at Chris Wood, for instance, getting in yeah, a couple of goals. Yeah, Woody's got two, two really good goals, really good finishes. Anthony's performance, more midfield players were good, you know, the real connection between the midfield players. So, like I said, we, we, <laughs> we're disappointed, of course, because of the way the game has ended and the result. Um, and it's a pity because of how we were playing, you know, because if... if if anything, that's as good as as comfortable as we've been in a Premier League game since since the start of last season. But but all of that is just me talking because of how the games ended. Um, just a word on a couple of players who weren't involved today. Yeah. If we make Callum Hudson Odoi and Divock Origi as, as well, uh, are they on the injured list? Yeah, Callum's off for six weeks. Divock uh, a few weeks less than that. Um, so we didn't have a great week really, and we didn't have any natural attacking changes to make in in, in the game today because obviously Tai Wu's not back with us either. So it was unfortunate, really, but um, but still, we never didn't use it as an excuse. We we had a plan for the types of changes that we would have to make. Um, it's just one of them things you have to deal with injuries. It's a plan that was working. Well, and, and that, like I said, it's um, it's one that's going to grind a little bit tonight and tomorrow and probably the coming days. You know, I, I won't look forward to waking up tomorrow morning. I know 
I'll wake up whatever time I wake up, I probably won't be in the morning. But um, yeah, it's like I said, loads of really good things in the game, but it's hard to talk about that too positively because because of how you know the game the, the score is finished.